My father-in-law is an amazing man. Even if you pay him money, he won't appreciate you. <laughs> and he is from the traditional English system where even if you give him a photocopy, he will do proofreading. <laughs> he was there in the talk and providence it was, that night my dinner was in my in-law's place, so I had gone there. And as I started eating, somewhere from behind my father-in-law came and he said, today your speech was a garland full of roses. I was about to get heart attack because my father-in-law never praises anybody. Before I could even enjoy that moment, he said, but there were four thorns in it today. I used the F word four times that day in the talk and this man was counting. I immediately turned towards, somebody tells you you're wrong, if you agree, you're not human being. You should immediately justify. So I immediately told him, Appa, you should know that all the youth come to my program because I speak their language. My father-in-law immediately told me, you have such a cheap estimation of youth. You think bad words is youth, then you have not understood youth. And most importantly, you should know, Swami Vivekananda did not have to speak filthy language to bring youth to his programs. And then he said, I thought you had it in you to be a Vivekananda, but now it's very clear. And he went inside. I wanted to call him Appa, Swami Vivekananda, Swami Vivekananda, he went inside. <laughs> After some time, that man came back and talking about one moment only is required for transformation. It's the intensity with which you absorb certain things in life. You don't need a lifetime to get transformed. One incident here, one sentence here, one moment there, one trigger there, one accident here, one incident there, one relationship gain, one relationship lost, one success, one failure, one moment is enough for it to be a turning point in your life. You have to have that moment when you will be thrown in the platform where a Mohandas Karanchan Gandhi can fall and rise as Mahatma Gandhi. You just need that moment. You have to need that moment to see somebody dying in the streets of Kolkata for a school teacher. To, I wish for some of you that trigger comes before six o'clock. My father just walked from behind and he said, everything that comes out of a human being stings. Our sweat stings, our phlegm stings, our saliva stings, our blood stings, our excretion stings. Everything that comes out of a human being stings. The only thing that comes out of a human being that can be sweet are your words. Let that also not sting. And I don't think I needed another moment after that. That moment I resolved from now onwards, anything that comes out of this tongue, should either make people happy or they should feel appreciated or they should feel encouraged or it should transform them. I will not use this tongue anymore to make anybody feel small or shrink them under any circumstance. And that one moment only was required for a transformation to happen.